So the FDA has authorized the second booster for two groups. The first is individuals who are 50 or above, and the second are certain immunosuppressed groups who are 12 or above. I think if you're deciding and when to decide if you should get the booster, there are a lot of factors to consider. So the first is, are you an individual that has comorbidities or is at a higher risk of severe illness, hospitalization, or death? Um, are you taking immunosuppressive medications, for example? Do you have certain chronic medical conditions that may predispose you to that? The second is, are you around other vulnerable populations frequently? For instance, do you live with your elderly parents? Are you around individuals, again, that are immunosuppressed or on chemotherapy, et cetera? Thirdly is what's your own risk tolerance and how risk averse or risk tolerant are you? And then lastly are other factors like are you traveling soon and do you live in an area that has high community transmission? First of all, this second booster is safe and that's the most important thing to know. I think secondly is there is preliminary data that the fourth dose in certain populations uh, that are at higher risk of illness, that the fourth dose does reduce that risk of hospitalization and death. And while this is preliminary data, we don't know what's coming down the pipe with BA2. So I think it was important to try and protect populations that may be at heightened risk of hospitalization and death. 